What's up gamers? Today we're playing Mei. This is a character that uh, apparently has existed for a very long time and is very popular, but I've never played them before, so here we are. You guys have been asking for it. I got a bit of a weird way to shoot. I don't know anything about them uh, because the workshop page literally says nothing about them. <laughs> All black cards seems to be less than average damage, also less than average speed, and a weird way to shoot. Seems like I shoot by just, you know, regularly shooting, but obviously there's some weird circle oval thing going on here. Here. So we're just gonna give this a shot. I imagine synergies with this character would go pretty hard as long as we're able to find them Just gotta take care of pride real quick. Goodbye. Anarchist is good to have honestly. Whoa, what? <laughs> oh, wow, that is weird. Okay, so it seems like if you stay still the tears go uh, like further away Yeah, look at this and then when I move they come back and you can apply this to also shooting for some reason Okay, some strategies forming in my head Obviously, I can't work with much until I get some tears and some new stuff but we'll keep it in mind. I am also spawning tears. Is this per like enemy I kill? I am definitely shooting more than what I was last room. I got like a little tiny version of what I have. My big version. What about in here? Do those last? Those do not last. We got brown nugget. We don't need this. Take it for the transformation progress. It seems like those tiny tears show up when I kill an enemy or maybe hit a tier and they can stack multiple times. At least for the room. I'm thinking it's on enemy death because I definitely hit pride a lot and nothing happened. But now that I'm killing enemies, these tiny tears are spawning. So that's my presumption here. This is a terrifying room. And I don't really know how to focus fire people with Mei, but we are living. I really could use Anarchist Cookbook in a greedy way to speed up the boss fight. But I'll do it the smart way and hopefully I get a secret room from it. This is a low chance, but better than just, oh, I'm lazy. I don't want to do the boss fight for as long as I would usually do it. Is there anything in here? You know, I probably... <laughs> Probably should have done the small room where the bombs did not have so much spread value and the likelihood of me even being able to accomplish said scenario was at least feasible, but not today. We move on, whatever, that secret room was nothing. Hello, Famine. Famine's done, definitely a low damage type of character, but I think once we do get synergies, they could definitely pop off. I got no other pickups. I'm really curious about the curse room, so I will. Despite my feeble amount of heart points, I'm certain that I can just, I'll muster through. No big deal. It's just the Binding of Isaac, dude. Unfortunately, it sucked. So I'm moving on later. Dross 1. Do I want to go Devils? I am so curious what Brimstone would do with this character. If I'm being real, I really want to know. But I also have to take into account, I don't have the most HP for that. What is this room? So I will decide if I'm not going Devils, or I will, by the end of the floor when I fight the boss and it's in front of my face. We'll take a look at the HP that I currently have on hand and make a definitive decision at that point. Nice amount of keys and pickups this floor. Hello, treasure room. Into mom's bottle. Don't know what's with all the really bad active items. Oh my god. At least Mega is a passive, I guess. Hey, May looks pretty cool in this costume, I think. Anything from this golden, maybe? If you could pop it open, please. Hey, nice. Counterfeit. We're gonna be seeing a lot of shops on this run, I have a feeling. That's always good for the health of the run. The more shops you can visit confidently, the better the run generally would be, in my opinion. It's so weird. I have to, like, shoot not directly at them, like you usually would with Isaac or any other Binding of Isaac character. It's more like I need to be slightly above or below axis of them. Only then would it work. Hello, super secret into dude by dude. Dude, sorry, it's nothing personal. I didn't even get anything, but eh, alright. Could the secret room not just be guaranteed here? Where in the hoo-ha is this thing? Is it not guaranteed there? What? It has to be here then. There you go. Okay, that makes more sense. Chest, hello, more bombage. Always good. Never disappointing when you get a bomb back after spending a bomb. I always feel like, hey, you know what? That's a good trade. And I never blame the game for that. Give me the shop moment into the broken stopwatch. You know, I will lock in the blowing up of the donation machine. Could be quite evil, I suppose, but I saw that nickel key beggar special dude over there. That guy had to die. It had to be done. Would you murder someone for a potential of five cents? I think it truly matters on how bad I want the five cents. <laughs> Blub, gone. Okay, goodbye leeches as well. We do have the HP necessary to facilitate a brimstone. Oh, but do I do it, dude? Not sure. 
Okay, well, it's not exactly what I was thinking. Uh, I'll stick with the 50-50 angel devil. May seems like that kind of person. Like, yeah, they could be misconstrued as a bad person. But I don't think intentionally, you know. Shooting at this character is very satisfying. It's a very unique playstyle. Never seen before, honestly. But I like it. It's nice. Treasure. Oh! Dude, the specialist for good items is causing errors? Click this message for more info. I can't. How can I click? I, I don't have a mouse. Do I? Oh my god, I do. Click the message. What's gonna happen? Okay, what is knife? Oh my god! <laughs> Wait, mom's knife does nothing? You're kidding me. <laughs> you- What? I- I thought there'd be a synergy. I- I thought- Okay, listen. There are a few times in my life where I feel like I have to redo something. <laughs> Oh my god, Bob's knife flew away, I'm mutant spider, does this do something? That's more like it, okay. That is so cool to look at, you know what this reminds me of? This is literally exactly one to one the world's hardest game. Meow. Dude, I loved grinding that game on like addictinggames.com as a kid. That thing was so lit. <laughs> I think that was actually during the period where I I don't know why I, I felt like I was the sickest gamer alive, to be honest with you. But I really wanted to play hard games. This was around the time Super Meat Boy was really popping off, you know? So I was playing Meat Boy, I got 100% on that, and I, I wanted to be really good at the world's hardest game. And I got okay at it, you know, I mean. I was in speedrunning, you know, like two minutes, world record, two million views on YouTube, but I could handle myself in that game pretty well. And that's exactly what these cubes look like. The way they're moving just reminds me of them. It Immediately. There were so many good games on addicting games. My other favorite one was like Stick Wars, I think it was called, where you made like stick figures fight each other and you had to like build resources. Yeah, looking back, I now realize that's an RTS. <laughs> I didn't know that until now, but that was literally just like the first and probably only RTS I ever played. But dude, that game was so nasty. Shop in here. We got voodoo moment. I will be taking anything else in here. I'm confident to spend some money. Not all of it though. No, thank you. We have a mirror dimension to check out. So we got some stuff to work with. Now I really do feel confident about taking care of this whole deal. Let's buy the bomb for the boss challenge and get a mom's key. Yeah, dude. With the amount of chests that we've been landing, mom's key is going to be mega value. Push the bomb in here, and then take self-damage, because you're so incredibly epic. And then I'm gonna pop Amicus here. Blub should die instantly, he did not. It's time for an anxiety attack. <laughs> That's okay though, honestly my damage is pretty immaculate, look at this thing. There's Turdlet fight, hopefully we don't get demolished by you. Hit a majority of my tears, we're still spawning those small ones as well. Nice, we got the split just before he charged. And then we can clean up really easily, very nice. Mirror dimension Turdlet this time. I'm definitely confirming for myself. Uh, that getting those mini tears is on some kind of enemy kill, because that fly gave me one, and now I don't have any more. Oh, never mind, there it is. Tiny as ever. I don't really know how it's working. I'm still thinking it's by enemy kill, though. Tears up. These are always good to find for us. We're gonna be able to shoot more, I think? Maybe it just swings faster? I'd probably get the tears back faster. We do have this guy with a bunch of money. Let's just try it. Rolling moment? Oh, definitely not. I'm taking the champion, man. That thing holds way too much value. Thank you. Now we're sitting at base damage, except we have all of these tiers rotating around us. So base damage does not do this justice. In all reality, we are a mighty powerful person. I am getting so much value out of these shops. Hold on. One more. See if we can blow this up. I don't know. I'm dancing. Guys, I paused too early, but I'm dancing. So my only thing I can say is this has to be stopwatch. That's the only quality four in the shop pool. There it is. Holy moly. And I got the cash for it. Counterfeit penny, man. What the? <laughs> Maybe a nickel too. Not so much. But the speed and stopwatch make this a completely crazy run. What an insane draws those, dude. May is looking like a really cool character. Except for the mom's knife thing. I don't know. I was expecting a synergy. I'm not gonna lie. So. <laughs> I'll be real when I have to be real. I was really expecting like four knives to fly around. But the mutant spider is, seems to be panning out way better for me anyway. And it's more satisfying to play with. We know May cannot get red HP uh, because we did not get red HP right there. I'm also not going to alternate floors for two reasons. One of them being that I did not have the ability. <laughs> I could have maybe if I used Anarchist Cookbook with that battery, but that also applies to the second reason why I did not want to go, which is I'm pretty sure this character does not work if you go to alternate floors. Not not work, rather more like if you encounter Clutch, it seems to hard crash your game. What's in this treasure room? Dirty mine, that's alright. Some oh crap transformation as well. Bunch of red chests in here, curse room moment. Guppy's paw. This is great. This is uh 
not useful for me. I'm gonna keep the anarchist. We gotta keep in mind we got no red hearts available. But the fact that it showed up is appreciated, especially because we have voodoo. We wanna lock in as many gupsters as possible. Maybe one here? No, that's all right. What about the shop? Treasure map? I take some map. I could go for super secret. In fact, I have not even gone for regular secret, surprisingly. So let's just weed that out, actually. Let's deduce. I mean, it seems like I exploded here thinking this was the secret room, but I can't tell if that actually hit. It's not to the left, that's for surely. What about down and right? Okay, so it is next to the shop. I think I just bombed it wrong. That or it's next to the treasure room, but that would just be unlucky. No, I just did not hit it into all of this stuff matchbook hey i get my bombs back and hp i thank you very gladly blow up all the mushrooms and now i'm net one bomb <laughs> what a massive play you guys think this is worth it you know what i bet you this is worth it in uh in la la land that's not all worth it whatsoever what am i talking about hello frail goodbye frail and hello more guppy this time we get tears and we have a lot more hp to spend abaddon okay i i'll take both of them here little delirium is definitely mid as hell but abaddon's cool and it's some hp up and if i'm gonna take one i'm gonna take both i would say nothing else to do nah nothing else to do let's go oh i like that my tears are red what? That shouldn't have happened. Unless that was custom made. Abaddon doesn't change your tears, does it? Oh, it does. It makes them red, like bloody red. But it's cool that it works with May as well in its own unique way. Sure thing, I'll take the algaes. And then let's go explore. Here they are. Been waiting for you guys. Hello, pins as well. You know, I think May's damage is significantly good. I understand I have mutant spider and I got cool synergies that are making it work. But either way, I mean, not that much damage up. Five base, but it doesn't feel like five base at all. What I am shooting is far more impressive. Hot bombs kind of dookie. I take it though, thank you. I look really cool, that's for sure. Like, my character looks so awesome, especially with the horns. Whoa. We got coupon here. Eh. Playing card, rules card, chub dislikes smoke. You know, I feel like it doesn't say that anymore. What about this pill? Paralysis moment. I'll take the algaes and leave then. Oh, wait, hold on. Blow up you. Might as well. There's like no reason not to do it every single floor at least once. What are you, per throw? Before the boss? Algaes again. Okay, I'll use it on the boss. Thanks for the free bloat fight, man later wow that is really actually really good damage that is powerful hp turns into another black heart interesting that it defaults to a black heart and not a soul heart like it's specifically a black heart so maybe she is more evil morally than i was thinking also interesting did that turn into one and a half black hearts or did i misread that let's go fight mom and let's figure that out okay arcade to the right we have five cents coming to this floor so that would make sense it would be either a arcade or a library we got an arcade with golden penny meaning i'm hoping for sure that the restock machine is in the shop and it's not like greed or something that would be a devastating blow you later curse room gaming again nice sure okay i'll take it to see if it does something and if it does anything and i mean literally anything i'll keep it but if it does nothing i'm gonna leave it alone charge shots it does nothing so uh where did all these poops come from <laughs> when did i become poop meister himself the lord of number two like hello what's happening here look at this this is what i'm talking about earlier where I, I have to stand off axis if you try and shoot someone directly like you'll hit some stuff but doing this you know that's far more condensed to damage and i like that it's, it's a unique way to shoot we got a sun card here this is just flight i might as well just use it so i get half price for curse room let me in here. Double red chest again. These have not been paying out. But the treasure room has bloody lust. And I like this item, so thanks. That's pretty weird how if I like press left, right, left, right, it actually looks like World's Hardest Game. <laughs> There's no other comparison to be made there. I can't I can't get a different comparison. You think I'm god or something? There's nothing else to be made there other than that is World's Hardest Game. You know, you're not supposed to do this room like that. I'm surprised I did not get punished and die. <laughs> supposed to do the left and right one first and then the center. Hot whoopsies! One might question why you might spend a key to open a lock when you can just fly over. That person should not be questioning anything. Obviously, I'm a gamer here. Do we just send it? I think we do. And for fun, I'm gonna press spacebar. I don't think this is like worth it. I would not usually do this, but I want to see what happens. Half price on the health bar? Anarchist, dude, you are like built, my man. This thing is Mongo Clutch. Do we go down? You know what? We are committed to devils. We want to get the guppy. Sure thing. Hey, these are all great. I'm going to take both. Even though the left one, I think literally does nothing. 
Actually, it's flight. I don't have flight. I thought I had flight because of uh, the reverse sun. I don't. But I want to take both because it's going to be Leviathan. So we're going to actually have a lot of HP here. But to be real with myself, a lot of HP or an HP that you're comfortable with? Because this is not a lot. Three hearts, man. Three hearts on Woo. Extra large? I didn't expect extra large. XL's come here to uh, give me a little bit of fear. We got to figure out where the boss is. I'm going to bank on bottom right. But I, I have a feeling it's like upstairs or something. Let me go for the secret room. Yeah, man. I mean, three hearts. Obviously, I can clutch it out, but I play a little... Ah, see? He, he. I play a little bit sloppy. And immediately, uh, the heart rate kind of pumps up. Now we are in a high-pressure situation. Let's look for tinted rocks and make our way to the boss as soon as possible. We cannot hang around the womb. I really shouldn't be shooting the king uh, guy because that guy has like triple HP as a champion, I think. But I got really lucky with the fear shot. He just didn't want to look me in the eyes. You saw that? That man does not know how to give a conversation. You're supposed to look people in the eyes. I know that it can be scary, but just know that it, you're also trying to make them comfortable when you're doing this. It's not all about you. There's a day cause. <gasps> Quick! reduce the floor by half <laughs> i always kind of wanted that to be a thing i know it would literally probably never be possible in terms of modding but man that would be so cool you use a day gauze on an x flow floor and like somehow i don't know it gets chopped in half i don't know why you would ever want to do that but man that sounds cool i'm gonna check down here there's no way this is the boss okay it seems kind of dumb but it seemed like a dead end there could have been a boss here and you guys have seen it before womb xl tends to have really weird layouts xl floors in general sometimes where like the boss will be like two rooms away from the starting room it makes no sense might as well have checked for that discrepancy not the case so i'm gonna just take pills shot speed up okay and hp up speed down okay feeling better about my hp and now i'm gonna go to where i'm certain the boss is which is over here and i was right hello mr freddian actually that doesn't even have to be mr fred it probably is but maybe it's double trouble hello Nah, it's Mr. Fred. <laughs> What's good, dude? How you doing? Look at this. I'm using the outer range of May, where like she stands still and the range goes higher to specifically take care of this enemy. It's not very effective, but man, did I feel cool. Like we have one and a half and it went to, it went to, I, could, or as I saw it. Every single HP up is one and a half black hearts of this character. I'm telling you, man, the Steam Workshop page said nothing. So I'm trying to gleam everything I can, but that is also the fun of it. So I can appreciate that. Goodbye, it lives. You won't be living as much as you your name implies it do i get a deal no holy fine boom you just gotta hold that i'm gonna check these other areas and usually i wouldn't do this but i know i have one other curse room maybe i got a library you know i mean it's womb xl so there could be some big stuff here at least towards the tail end in terms of special rooms i'd like to participate please yeah here it is it's maybe worth it hold on full health pill and telepills me out and hi beggar beggar i play and i get a portable slot wow <laughs> anything over here no this was a mob challenge room good to know hello worms get out of here and this one had nothing all right really okay never mind i cleared out what i wanted to find so that's okay we will go down sure okay definitely bottom left this time monstro 2 staying as tanky as ever that's my only complaint about this guy i don't even think it's a bad thing it's just the fact that you cannot deny monstro 2 always tends to feel like he has a little bit more hp than that guy probably should have like if monstro 2 had five percent less hp i don't think anyone would notice but everyone would notice like it would be a, a change that would feel natural <laughs> i do have an incubus for a second look at this Mutant spider, cursed eye. Never mind, it's gone. I'm so sad. That incubus, I don't know, it meant a lot to me. It was down here. Yeah, it was, okay. I almost guessed incorrectly. <laughs> Yellow. Hi, Satan. One, two, three, and four, and five. That's right, I remembered. Stop, watch, you got nothing on me. I improved as a human and as a Binding of Isaac player every single day of my life. Get out of here. I'm gonna pop the Anarchist on you to see what happens. Get some bomb damage in. The hot bomb's also clutching it out. I can't believe Anarchist is like the redemption underdog story of today, but I'm totally with it, man. This is sick. All right, Satan is gone. I am interested in this dark room. How many guppy items do we have? Only one? Huh, okay, maybe we'll get a dead cat. Good morning, gamers. Welcome to the dark room. Enjoy your stay. Hello, mother void. I'd love it, but it would be such a detriment to my HP. A uh, cambion, no. A quarter, no. And begotten, no. Okay, actually, of all of these, I will take Maw of the Void. I'm gonna wait every single room before I just, like, walk in. 
Just have a Ma available. It's going to be useful. I don't think we can take tears anymore, but I'll take it anyways. It's my goal, I think, to full clear this entire floor. It's going to be a rough one. And if I find the lamb early, I might just go. <laughs> I do not want to be dying. But I've been having a lot of fun with this character. And trying to play them has been really sick. They actually have really cool synergies and ways to shoot. And they are not easy. <laughs> I really thought this would be like a crazy ass character that's just like mega easy. But no, this is a really balanced. This feels great to play. I can see why this is one of the most popular modded characters. A very clean polish to them. I appreciate it. What is that? Super Sloth, you dropped a chaos card whoa buddy you trying to give me the free win let's use it on the lamb i actually don't know this and this is where we're gonna learn together unless you guys know this which you know you probably do but my bad if you use chaos card on the lamb does it just separate the body and the head or does it just take care of the dude outright in my head my binding of isaac brain wants to say hello cone head that was funny that we just found you that it would just separate them but deep down, I think I have absorbed knowledge in my past knowing that the lamb just dies. And I'm gonna go with my gut feeling. I think he's just gonna die. Place your bets, ladies and gentlemen. Write them down in the comments. Figure out if you're right later on and then brag that you're the best gamer. <laughs> this is probably the way to the boss. Ah, whatever, I'll just go. Okay, this is the way to the boss. Let's just take care of all of these dudes. No chest. Do I risk these other rooms, man? I will. I will. Because I'm really believing in the fact that the lamb's just going to insta-die the chaos card. So that is a free room. The way I'm perceiving it. I, I hope I'm right. So until I'm down to 1 HP, there's just no risk here, I don't think. I could get hit twice in a room, but I don't see that happening either because I got a really powerful run. What? Whoa, where did I get all of those tears from? That was sick. Was that from shooting the fire or something? Like I farmed my tears on that? I bet it was. Yeah, look at that. You can farm your tears, your mini tears on like obstacles the same way we did with the Grimace. Oh, hello chest. Epiphora. This is probably really cool. Let's see in real time what having tears up with Mei does. Like my tears are going up right now. Ah, they literally spin faster and probably come out faster, you know? Wow, that's really cool. And then what if I stand still and it spreads out? Whoa! I think that looks so insanely cool, dude. I actually think that looks awesome. Average Teratoma room. Putting mad effort into this one. Man, Teratoma almost killed me. Holy. Phew, that was a close one. No chest today? I mean, that makes sense. My luck has been pretty low. I have no tail. How about I pop the Anarchist on the double fallen room? See what happens, took care of one of them, split these guys. Very cool, very clean dark room. We did not get hit at all, really. I almost walked into that thing. Okay, let's see what happens with the chaos card. Hello, lamb. Uh, um, Shia Kazing. Hey, it does work. I would not like to do a victory lap, and we do not even get the chance of delirium. That was May, and that was super duper clean. I hope you guys enjoyed your stay. I love you guys, and GG.